to help you put things into perspective. This Fiat is actually roomy enough for five adults. The front seats, of course, offer the expected amount of space and attention to driver and passenger. As for the rear, it uses a stadium seating approach to make it workable for up to three adults. Of course, there's space for luggage or cargo. 22 cubic feet with the rear seats up and 68 cubic feet of space when they are folded flat. With four trim levels, the 500L can be anything from a functional transport for a small family up to a near luxury experience when it's loaded up. Our test unit was the Trek model with the designer label influenced interior that was evident from the maroon seats to the Beats audio system. At this level it comes with 17 inch wheels while the base unit has 16 inch rims. Under the hood is the 1.4 liter multi-air turbo engine which can operate on 87 octane unleaded fuel but does much better when premium is in the tank. The official numbers are 160 horsepower and 184 foot-pounds of torque. But since this is a rolling box design, fuel economy isn't near the 40 miles per gallon range. We did like that a six-speed manual transmission is available, and paired with electric power steering, the 500L proved easy to maneuver in traffic as well as on the open road. For Fiat, the 500L gives the brand a boost with a larger platform to offer drivers in North America while retaining the concept and image of a small, nimble, European-styled vehicle. This is Greg Morrison. We want to know what you think, so email us. The address is bumper to bumper tv at cs.com.